This is our 2018 uh, Silverado. It's a 2500 diesel, so it's got the 6.6. .6. Um, it's got 22,800 miles on it, just under. So it's all, it's an LTZ, so it's got all the features. Um, and somebody did, I mean, obviously everything's blacked out. Somebody threw BDS suspension on there, so it's got control arms, um, coilovers in the front, shocks in the rear. Um, I'm not sure, I assume these are like the Rhino Industries rims. But I'm not too sure. I haven't looked. Uh, it's got the N-Fab uh, rock sliders on the sides. It's got Fox in the rear. Okay. Fox shocks in the rear. Let's see. Giant steel bumper. ADD off-road. Smoked taillights. Got the bed cover. got some pod lights in there and that's cool a little storage did not know that was a thing magnaflow exhaust tip I wonder if it's a oh yeah it might be a full magnaflow exhaust all right it's the z71 off-road package so you've got WeatherTech floor mats, leather seats, um, they are heated. You've got parking sensors, uh, the exhaust brake, you've got heated and cooled seats too. I forget you have the AC seats with the, L the uh, LTZ. Um, it's got, let's see, the sunroof, um, the rear window that slides open, memory seats. Um, you know, power folding mirrors, a Bose sound system, all kinds of goodies. Automatic climate control. Let's see, pedal adjustment here, and switch your switches there. Lights in the bed, traction control, obviously. There's your parking sensors you can turn on or off. Um, exhaust brake. Not sure that's, I don't think that is a downhill assist control. I'll have to look at what the gun on is. So, as far as your screen goes, you can connect the phone to it. Um, you know, it's got Bluetooth, you can take phone calls, you've got steering wheel controls. like you've got the phone charger here which doesn't work because I've got an iPhone 7 um, but it does work for any other iPhones let's see I'm not sure what that is I'll have to check alright oh, the condition of the inside is pretty good I mean the passenger seat can be better than the driver's seat but got a little bit of stretching some wrinkling here but you know if none of it's ripped it's not stretched open center console looks good where everyone puts their elbow uh, yeah driver's seat's looking pretty good steering wheel looks good no rips there it's got your four-wheel drive and your trailer brake controls on that side tint on the rear windows um, the paint looks pretty good I mean it's a black truck so it shows scratches it's got a good scratch there uh, you can't get a nail in it so that'll buff out tailgate's got that looks like a little touch up paint a couple little spots there like, yeah it looks like some more touch up there backup camera little paint chipping here for that uh, I assume that's the light for the uh, license plate but it's also been painted got some scratching back there just little
little spots here and there. Um, a little scratched up behind that handle. Some paint coming off on the uh, painted emblem there. Mirrors aren't too beat up. Nobody's smashed those into anything. Grill's painted black. Badge is painted black. Look at that. They did leave a little chrome there. Got a couple rock chips here and there, but not so bad. Uh, nothing in the windshield. This mirror, same thing. Maybe some light scuffing, but I mean, you know, nothing you'd care about, nothing you'd want to repaint. Some scratch on the door handle here. So, this emblem is doing better. Off that one. Rock sliders are in really good condition. Looks like they've got a bed line around there. It's hard enamel. All right. And then I guess I can show the back seat. Back seat always looks better than the front seat. So, yep. No stretching. No tears. No fading. Nothing. And again, the WeatherTech mat back here as well. Alright, I think that about does it. There we go. 2018 Chevy Silverado 2500.